Glasgow by Catfish and the Bottle Men. So I've probably had more requests for this song than any other, so I thought I'd do a quick video. So it starts like this. So, I'm going to show you the right hand first, and then I'm going to show you the chords. So for the right hand, the thumb is going to stay on the A string. The first finger is going to stay on the D string most of the time. Sometimes it will go to the G string. The third finger is going to move mainly between the B string and the G string. So, for example, the first part of the song. So the we got thumb on the A, D string and B string. So here's the pattern, so all of them together, thumb, fingers, thumb, fingers, thumb. And again, and that's the main pattern throughout the song. So there I'm playing the A, D and G string. So one more time, we've got thumb, first finger, middle finger on the B, and thumb, first finger, middle finger on the G. There are a couple of occasions where we're going to play thumb on the A, and then we're going to play first finger on the G and first finger on the B but I will tell you where they are when we get to them. So, now that we've had a look at the picking pattern, let's have a look at the chords. So first thing to note, there's a capo on the 7th fret, and it's standard tuning other than that. So the first chord is open A, 2nd fret of the D, open G, and 1st fret of the B. And we've got that picking pattern that we did earlier. Then, everything off, back to the same chord we did a minute ago, it's basically an A minor 7, then we're going to play 3 on the A, 2 of the D and open G, then take your first finger off and play the same picking pattern, Then bring your third finger underneath to three on the D. And then back to three on the A, two on the D and open G. So together. Repeat that. Then it's basically a C chord first finger off, third finger down on the third fret of the D, and then back to the C chord. So you play that through a few times, and that is your verse. Then we've got So again, we're now on the A, D and G chords here, and we've got two on the A, two on the D, open G, the picking pattern is the same, then we've got two on the A, one on the D and open G, then we've got two on the A, open D, open G. Then we're going to come up to 4 on the A, 2 on the D, and open G. So 
again. So that was 2-2 two, two open, 2-1 two, open. 2 open open. 4 2 open. And then we got this bit. So, back to our C shape again. So we've got 3 on the A, 2 on the D, open G. Slide that up two frets, so we got five on the A, four on the D, open G. Then third finger comes under here and plays five on the D, and then the open G. So slowly, up two frets, third finger underneath. Type section. And that kind of repeats. So same picking pattern. We're going to start with the A minor 7 shape, so open A, 2 on the D, 1 on the B. Take them off and use the same picking pattern and the same strings. Then we're going to play open A, 2 on the D, 2 on the G. Then open A, open G and open B. So we haven't used that chord before. So again, that's open A, open G, open B. Then we're going to play this one again, which is open A, two of the D, two of the G. And then we're going to play the C shape, so three, two, and open. And then every now and then we're going to take off the open D string and then hammer down onto the two. So again, slowly. Open A, G and B. Same shape here. And then it plays that whole section twice. The last time or the second time. goes through there a bit slower and then all the rest of the parts are the same etc and that is how you play Glasgow by Catfish and the bottle men.